and hello to you all welcome back to my channel and i want to thank you so much for watching in this video i will be showing you how i turned some shower rings into a glamorous wall decor i purchased these from dollar tree and i used a total of 28 packs And just to make sure that these all had an even coat of spray paint, I made sure that none of them was touching. And I also made sure that all the shower rings were closed. I did two coats of spray paint, making sure the first one was dry before I applied the second. purchased these two inch mirrors off of Amazon which I will be sure to leave the link down below. And so just to make sure that these had a clean and elegant look, I made sure that where the shower rings are closing at, that they were all facing each other. Therefore, when I added the mirror, it can cover that part up. If this is your first time to my channel, it is definitely a pleasure to have you here. If you haven't already, please subscribe and don't forget to hit that notification bell. As you can see, I started putting the glue right where the design started on the rings. I also was using the line on my board just to make sure that each piece that I made came out even.
And just to bring my vision to life that I had for these, I ended up making a total of five columns. My longest one was a total of 112 rings. And that is because I wanted it to go from my ceiling to my furniture. The two next to that will have a total of 72 rings. And then the two next to those will have a total of 40 rings. So I made sure I added a lot of different angles within this video, just so you guys can see exactly how I achieved this look. I knew my middle column would have a lot of rings on it, so I did a test run with two different glues on my two smallest columns, being the ones that have 40 rings on it. One I did with an E6000 glue, and another I did with Gorilla Glue. And I would definitely recommend using E6000 glue if you are inspired to do this look that I did. I connected two of the pieces together until I achieved the length that I was going for. I then went back and added a mirror to every other space just to make the design more sturdy as well as enhance the look. With my living room, I was doing like a theme on circles. So to get inspired, I was going through videos and I came across a design that I seen Dazzling Designs by Denise do. So I thank you. After completing this project, I went through and cleaned all the mirrors off. I love, love, love the way this turned out. Check out the finished look.